X5P.com right now, 300K is below $12. When you use code CUTE at checkout, go to X5P.com, save your money, go get the team you want, go have the fun you want, stop gambling your money, go have the fun you've been waiting on. All right, guys, welcome back. Top 10 running backs. Let's get to it. Now, before we get started, I'm going to explain to you about two running backs that did not make the list and why. Subscribe if you're new. I do at least three videos a day. Barkley videos out right now. Go see him in action. Up next, I have a running back tier list. Let's get to why Aaron Jones did not make the list. All right, you see they gave him high trucking, high break tackle, all of this, right? Um, what's wrong with this card is his abilities. They didn't even give him Bruiser, but he's supposed to be like a power guy. You're not going to be able to, to really use him as like a trucking kind of break tackle guy. He does not do well. His APs are horrible. Um, one of these should be a zero. It's not. Um, he does not get really any great discounts at all. So he's, that's why he's not on the list. Also, it's not on the list. It's going to be Hines. He's new. 95 Excel right now feels pretty outdated. Uh, he's not strong. He's not 200 pounds. He does not run people over. He gets ran over. Okay. His break tackle to 91. It, it might as well be a 70. He does not break tackles at all. If he does, you're very lucky. Um, his abilities could be way better. I mean, they really also screwed up his abilities. That's why he is not on the list or Aaron Jones, but who is number 10? And it is gonna be Jamal Charles, 97 speed, 97 excel. This guy here can juke spin. He's not gonna run the by over, not get a bunch of broken tackles, not a bunch of button battles either. Now, what does he do? He gets better abilities than the ones we just shown. He gets short and elite for zero which is more important as if you're just gonna dump the ball off to him and beat like a man blitz. But I'm gonna tell you, the difference between him and Hines, he's gonna break way more tackles than him. He's gonna get more broke, like button battles. He's not amazing at it, but man, is he better than Hines for sure. Um, I like this guy way better. And yeah, I would not be getting Hines if you have the chance to get Jamal Charles. Next is Austin Eckler. This guy here gets okay speed and excel. Obviously, his excel is better than like a Hines. Um, I will say his catching is great. Trucking does not work with this card. Brick tackles are not common, even though it says 97. Do not trust that. I'm going to tell you right now, short and elite with route technician. That means this guy is going to be one of the best out of the backfield as far as getting open and running crisp routes. This guy is shifty and if you need to get some separation on him running a route he can do that for you and that's why he's higher than the other running backs on the list next leon yes he has great speed uh but this is just not all about speed i do want to point out that um trucking with this car is impossible his break tackle says 95 that is false and i would like to say yeah he's gonna be a great guy to dump the ball off to juke spin all that if you need somebody to go between the tackles, this is not going to be your guy. I will say short and elite for zero is nice with the route technician. Do not put tank on him. Um, that's not even what kind of running back he is. So yes, he gets some good abilities to get out of the backfield to catch the ball. And yes, he has high catch ratings and he runs crisp routes. Um, so yes, he's a step faster than Austin. That's why he's a little bit higher on the list, but who's next? Now CMC plays very similar to the other two cars that he's ranked above for Austin and Leon. Um, but here's the difference. He actually fights for you. He falls forward a little better. He breaks more tackles. He'll get you a couple more button battles. It's not gonna be a world of difference, but he also has 99 Excel and I really like that. So him getting out is going to be easier um, to get the first step on people and of course he gets short out or short and have everyone run with route technician this guy here also gets backfield master so uh catching the ball in the backfield with him and you need somebody to break a tackle he's gonna be better than leon and austin so who's next really like this fournette card 
Uh, if you guys haven't tried him and you'd like a power back for 400k, he's gonna be great. His speed is good enough, actually. His juke and spin are good, but they're not gonna be like a CMC level, so do keep that in mind. They get a little bit better animations. He's definitely not gonna have like a Barkley type of juke at all. His, his trucking is crazy. He's over 230 pounds. So this guy here does fall forward. If he's somebody between the tackles, you can get him. Now here's what you could do. You get him between the tackles, right? And then you can get like um, Austin or McCaffrey for outside. You can do that. Um, I like Bruiser way better than Tank. I put Bruiser and short end on him and I wouldn't worry about the other ones. That's how I would set him up. This guy is gonna be um, very effective in short yardage situations. Up next is CMC. This guy is still over a million coins. Speed in Excel is insane. Trucking is non-existent. Break tackles is actually better than you think. He breaks more tackles than CMC, Leon, and Austin. So do keep that in mind if you're wondering about clearing up that picture. I just really wanna clear that up for you. Um, I do like uh, this guy as far as shiftiness. Now, if you ask me, name one running back you need this to juke and spin and zigzag with, I'm gonna say CJ's more shifty, okay? Uh, so that's why I'm gonna have him higher on the list also because he's faster. Do not put tank on him. Uh, put short in elite and evasive. Evasive's not that great though. I really wouldn't worry about it. I would just put short in elite and leave him like that. Um, but this card here is super shifty. Up next is Barkley, 97 speed, 97 excel. This guy here has juke and spin. Yes, um, I would like to say his trucking is not the best. Um, he definitely does not truck like a Fournette or a bow or a quad father or a king, okay? He does not do that. So this 96 truck did not fall for that. Also his X Factor, ankle breaker and first one free are not that great. They're not going to be game breaking. They're not like freight train, something like that. So, short and elite is nice. Um, his ability should be better, uh, but I would put Bruiser and short and elite is what I would choose. Bruiser's gonna help us trucking, but he's still not gonna get the animations of like a Bo Jackson. Um, falling forward, he did okay. His catching was great, actually. Um, but if you haven't tried this card, you can try him out. The video of him is up right now on my channel. If you wanna see him in action, I already did that video this morning. Go check it out. Without the crazy X Factor, Bo Jackson's the best running back. I'm telling you, on my team, I have the Sprinter Strat card on him. It gets him to 97 Excel. He's a legend steam team, so it gets him 98 with 98 speed. This guy's good. And it's not because of his speed, it's because of he can break tackles and fall forward. This guy gets crazy animations. People fall off of him. And for under 400K, uh, for 360, 350, this guy's a steal. You better go get him right now. Prices are dropping because people are buying Barkley because they don't know that Bo is better than Barkley. So please save your coins, go get Bo. He gets short in and bruiser. That's all I would put on him. I wouldn't worry about anything else. This guy gets crazy animations, go get him. Still a 96 overall. Yes, quad father, I can't lie to you guys. The X Factor is still crazy when it's lit up. You guaranteed break the first tackle. That's insane. He's under 200K. You still have to buy the other cards to put it in the 93 and the 88. So do keep that in mind. So that's going to be about another 100K. Um, so, but this guy here, even without his X Factor, say it's not activating, you run with him. His, his trucking is crazy. He still breaks tackles. Obviously not to the level when he's activated, but this guy is amazing with his X Factor still at number number one get king is still the king it's crazy he's a step faster than quad and he also gets short and elite for, for one and bruiser for zero this guy here when his x factor is activated he's breaking the first tackle unless they have secure tackler which i would suggest that putting him on your players uh i really would um now this guy here even when he's not activated, breaking tackles, falling forward is amazing. But it's this X Factor keeps him at number one with his speed not being the best. It doesn't matter because if you know how this game works, when you break a tackle, you like burst forward. It makes no sense and it really helps him 
Um, he's still number one. He's still the king. That's gonna do it for me. Be kind for no reason. Help each other. Encourage each other. I'll see you in the next video, which is the running back tier list.